Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a frustrating issue that many MongoDB developers encounter. Our viewer asks, why does insert many always return a duplicate ID error? Let's break down the problem. Our viewer is trying to insert multiple documents into a MongoDB collection using the insert many method. However, they keep running into a duplicate key error, specifically with the ID field. The viewer's code shows that after attempting the insert, all objects in the array end up with the same ID value, which leads to the conflict. This raises the question, why is insert many generating duplicate object IDs? Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution that you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully get through to that resolution. Let's get started. Let's address the issue you're facing with the insert many function in MongoDB. The error indicates that there are duplicate ID values being generated. When you use insert many, MongoDB automatically generates an object ID for each document unless you specify an core ID. If the documents already have an ID, MongoDB will attempt to insert them as is. In your case, it seems that the first document is inserted successfully, but subsequent documents are being assigned the same object ID, leading to the duplicate key error. To resolve this, ensure that each document in your docs array either has a unique ID or none at all. If you want MongoDB to generate unique object IDs, simply remove the ID field from your documents. After making these changes, try running the insert many function again. This should resolve the duplicate ID error and allow all documents to be inserted successfully. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. This user faced a duplicate ID error when using insert many. They were inserting large batches of documents and suspected the issue was related to the driver generating the ID field. To work around the error, they created their own ID field using the UUID library. This allowed them to avoid the duplicate key errors. They installed the UUID library and modified their documents by appending a unique UUID to each one. They hope this solution helps others facing the same issue. And that's it, guys. I hope you found the answer that you're looking for and got to that resolution in the end. If you did, please take a moment, hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. Until the next time you need more technical videos, I hope you have a great day. Cheers. <laughs>